Hey everybody, this is Timothy 4040. I'm talking quietly because my nosy daughter came over to visit. So this will be the quickest uh, video. So I went to Walmart to look at the Halloween candy. Never did make it over there. Maybe they clean Walmart out by my house. So I went in there to get um, a few things and changed my mind when I got in there. So I just went looking in the beach. Not many packets, but they were only 98 cents. Then I got these baby blue. And then I got these um, charms. These are hearts. And they have the holes in them from each side. What else? So that's it. Then I treated myself to Hard Candies Velvet Mousse, which is a matte lip color. This is in the shade 1078, which is Wisteria. Wisteria. And that's what she looks like. She's a um, cherry color with a little purple, but it's supposed to be velvet. So I'm going to try that out. I got all of these on sale for 98 cents. And these are the ones from Halloween and some regular scents. But I got Berry Curious. I've used Berry scent before. And I keep milk and honey, milk and golden honey in the um, kitchen. Now, that's a 5.5 ounce bottle. This is a 7.5 ounce bottle, and they were both 98 cents. So, I got um, these Wispies, they were from a Halloween collection, so they were still ringing up 324 at the register. But on the app and the phones that the employees use, these are ringing up a dollar 79. A dollar 79, I'm going back and get some more. But the Walmart I went to had the baby Wispies and the Demi's. I had some other ones that I didn't like. But I got these four for $1.79 a piece and these two for $1.79 a piece. I also got these polishes from the Halloween collection by Salon Perfect. And this is a limited edition um, there it is. Come on. Lust at First Bite 964 which is the gold glitter and I got a top coat. Then, um, all of these were a dollar, and these are the Freeman masks. I got mud masks, I got clay masks, I got um, a peel off clay mask for my daughter, which has lemon and um, sweet tea and lemon. I got the gel cream mask, and a gel bubble mask, and another clay mask that has uh, dead sea minerals. So I got these for a dollar each, and then these snapples were a dollar. So I had five. My daughter got me for one. So I'm gonna stock up on these. Try to quit for drinking soda. That's it. That's all. And you all have a good afternoon. This Diva T4040. Hey everybody, this Diva T4040. Really quickly, this is part two. Actually, this is two days, and um. So, I got invited to go have girls lunch with a friend of mine. I hadn't seen my girlfriend, my good, good girlfriend, as uh, Lonnie says. And uh, so, we went to Applebee's and did the two for 20. So, to walk off some of that, I ran a couple of errands, paid a couple of bills, and stopped by a store that's not near me anymore, which is Family Dollar. So, I went to Family Dollar, I went to Walgreens. And, you know, you can't win for losing. 
I got tired and started painting, painting as the country people say, having pain more than I should, so I knew I needed to get home. Stopped by the mailbox or the business center to go to the mail inside to the mailbox, and instead of backing my car in, I put it in. I just got a starter put on two days ago, Thursday. Uh, and yeah, go to get back in the car and it won't catch to turn over. So now the mechanic's saying the posts may not be getting enough charge to catch. I'm not a mechanic or mechanically inclined, so you know I'm upset because it's Saturday and uh, if he can come by, he will. If he can't, I can't complain. Um, so having a, a mechanic plan is one thing getting the mechanic to come is another when they live in another town so anyway i was able to go get me a couple of snacks because i was gonna have movie night and uh all of that trying to get used to this living single all the children are out and empty nester and all of that so i stopped by this family dollar this family dollar is on the street uh all the businesses on this street are owned not by black not by whites. They, the buildings may be on, but they're run by Hispanics or um, Asian or Islamic people, I'm, which I'm not judging. It's just this one strip of street is where a lot of businesses are that are not in English. So, thank goodness they do hire English-speaking people. So, I went to this family dollar. And when I say this family dollar is about the size of my downstairs living room, but they have it chock full. So, you know, the family dollar and the dollar general, they be in the hood, got all the best stuff and everything has a sticker price on it. You know, a sticker price on it. And if they scan it and it's different, they go out a sticker. Yeah, that type of neighborhood. So I hadn't been to a family dollar, I know, in at least three years. So I went in there and I went in there to find what I'm going to show first. These pain patches. I normally show the pain patches I get from um, Dollar Tree, which is the Absorbing Junior. But I have been looking for these Tiger Balm patches that I used to get from Big Lots. And, and uh, Big Lots stopped carrying them or stopped getting them or whatever. But these are the Tiger Balm pain relief patches. These are the bomb.com and they also have expiration dates on them so you know when they won't last. This is June 2020. Has a lot number and everything. I bought all they had and they had 15, but this little old white lady came in there looking for some she called them hold some stock uh she called them something, pantyhose is what we call them, stocking hosiery or something. But anyway, we got to talking and the girl that was helping me, the cashier we found the um, Absorbing Junior ones, but in Family Dollar, they were $1.85 a patch, which is not bad because they're a dollar in Dollar Tree. Um, but they only had like two. So then I was going to get the Asper Cream patches, which are rare to find. They were two eighty five. So I was going to mix. I wanted at least to get five patches because I go to physical therapy. And the night before I go to physical therapy or the night after, uh, the day of I go to physical therapy, I put on two pain patches when I finish and come home because I'm hurting because I've stretched and they've done things and all of that. So it has it been working for me and helping that my physical therapy lasts a little longer. I go twice a week. So I was going to get five. Two for Tuesday, two for Friday, and one for Wednesday in between. And that's what I do every week. So I was trying to see how many I could get. So there were 15 left of these. And these came up to be a dollar. So I got 10. I have 10 of these. I have 5 Absorbing Junior. And then I have other pain patches or heat patches. Which is what my physical therapist recommends rather than cold heat and cold patches. So I got 10 of those. And they had a 50% off basket. And I got a Clairol. I've used this before. This is the herbal color. Because I am, I want to say 40% gray, leaning to 50, uh, herbal colors work better on my gray or they last longer. They don't last forever because you can't color gray um, unless you, you know, bleach it first. So anyway, this is the color lock conditioner included. The color of this is called 48. This is Brazen Raisin. 
So it looks like a burgundy on camera, but it's more red. So I'm using my phone, and this is ammonia free, which I love. And I've, like I said, I've used this uh, brand before, but not this color. And I'm mainly going to color my roots. I'm not so much worried about um, coloring my whole entire head. I'll comb it through. And I am a cosmetologist, 27 years plus. So I do know what I'm doing. And I don't normally use box color, but when I started getting more gray, the, the herbal colors for any brand last longer on my gray. My gray is around my edges, front and back. And the roots down the center and now it's starting to spread but it won't come all the way through my shaft so I'm only 40% so I also got this e6000 I've been looking for the one with the little nozzle tip but Hobby Lobby is probably where I'm gonna have to go um this one was only three dollars so normally this is four five dollars in Walmart and this is a one ounce tube so I'm gonna try to find that nozzle because E6000 can get messy or in the tube. So I got that. So I also got me another, just because it was a dollar, LA Colors um, lip liner pencil. This is my favorite one. And this is Smooth Plum. And of course it looks lighter on camera. So I just got that because I broke the other one. And so these are what I got that were on the clearance. And... I'm trying to finish having enough. Uh, these are the vegan. Um, which way does this go? Okay, cruelty free, um, gluten free, vegan uh, brushes that everyone knows about the white ones. And the best way to get these, keep these clean, is use that soap, soap, and some apple cider vinegar. It just takes the color away. These are very soft. What I didn't have was the powder brushes. So these were $2.40, and when he rang them up, it was 50% off of that, so $1.20. So I got two. I have this thing about getting back up for the backup. So I got two powder brushes. There we go. Two powder brushes. I got a foundation brush for my cream foundation. Um, and this one was $1.20. He just rang it up because he said it, he wasn't going back there. Plus, there wasn't another one. And I just got me one more large eyeshadow brush. So, now I have four. And this was $0.80. Cents. So, on the way out up to the register, they had the 75 fluid ounce of extra sensational uh, laundry soap. So, that's the 75 ounce, two and a half quart. So, I got two of these. These were $2.00. Two dollars. Now I know some people don't believe in using, you know, but I'm not gonna pay eight dollars and all that for gain or whatever. What I do is I take the extra and I get those um, soap beads that are out now, and I stock up on those when they go on sale at um, Walgreens mostly, Big Lot sometime, H E B, which is the grocery store here, and uh, honey, and I just do that. And uh, so that's all I got from Family Dollar. Then I was going to go to uh, the store called Fries, and I changed my mind. And on the way home, I stopped through Walgreens. So at Walgreens, I was going to get some ice cream. It's not on sale. Uh, half a gallon is on sale for four dollars. But Walgreens sale starts at ten, but I left before then. Um, the new sale goes in from Saturday to Saturday. The prices change over at midnight. I used to work at Walgreens, but you can get some Saturday items on Sunday, depending upon the store. So they were pulling tabs when I went in there. I always go to the makeup aisle and chat them up. I was going back in there to see if the perfume was on sale from the previous video I shared in my Instagram that I shared about the uh, Rihanna Rebel and the, uh, not Michael Kors, the Kenneth Cole, um, not Reaction, but the one in the white bottle. I was given those two in the spray form for a gift as a thank you for something I did for someone. I wasn't expecting it, and they knew it, so they left it at my house. So, I now want the perfume. And Walgreens is having gift sets. Um, so, yeah, your girl got a, a wish list. I want gift cards to Walgreens. <laughs> Or I want the
the Vera Wang uh, perfume sets. It's two different sets. They're $22. But anyway, I digress. So I stopped through Walgreens, got my snacks. So I got my um, Pepsi and my Mountain Dew. This will last me for the week. And yes, I drink water. Yes, I drink a lot of it. But um, that's what I got for a movie night. So it's almost time for the movie. So let me get through. I got a thing of Pringles. These were $1.99. I had to splurge on the uh, Got To Be Glued uh, Blasting Freeze Spray because I put on a very pretty wig and didn't realize it didn't have combs in it. And I didn't have any left over to sew into the wig and I had to go. So I had to battle and I didn't put any bobby pins in it. So I had to battle the slide and I have gray on my edges where everybody in these videos have the pretty parts and you know the baby edges my edges are gray so until i color it i've got to lay these wigs down for just a little while my hair does not lay down you name a edge control i will prove to you that my hair will not lay down and i am natural almost 15 years and i'm this close to a tcb no lie relax but anyway this was 7.99 in walgreens and um I use my employee discount on this bad boy because I just can't see eight dollars and it rarely goes on sale here and I hate that so when you walk in the door to the uh, cosmetics aisle they have where are they they have um, these travel uh, items this brand is called uh, well it don't have a name I thought it did but it's right by the front and it's uh, a hanging thing and everything is a certain color, whatever, and you can get. So I got a mini, and they're on sale because I think they're getting rid of it. So these will make stocking stuffers and basket stuffers. I make baskets and gift bag stuffers. Um, this is a mini blender sponge. It was uh, 49 cents. This is a foam toast separator. It was 49 cents. And they only had one left in that little section. I have to try different Walgreens. So these files, I love these files. They just, they look like fashion files, but they really do work. They're, I want to say 80 grit. It doesn't say on here if it is, but it says it's a cushion nail file with medium and fine grit on each side of the emery board. The emery board is abrasive, but gentle for shaping and smoothing of the natural nails. So then directions on how to do it if you don't know how. But uh, these were 49 cents, so two for a dollar. I got one dollar. I got two dollars. So I got two gray and two green and white. And as you can see, they match with this when you want to put them for a little gift. So I literally spent two dollars, three dollars for all of these. And these normally are two dollars each or a dollar something. So then I went over to the counter. They had the Wet n Wild. Um, spray for $3.49 this is almost five or six dollars in Walgreens five dollars at least and I have the the uh, matte one and I haven't yeah I tried it when I was out of town so this is the natural so I'm gonna try this so the matte one worked perfect it, it really does work and I'm I'm not a setting spray person I always forget unless I'm doing someone else but I always forget and photo focus seems to work very well for me so then at the counter, I got this Jordana Glow and, Glow and Go Creamy Strobing Stick. Now, I'm not a big highlighter, the nose and cheeks and be looking like a deer caught in headlights. But I have begun to love the strobing and the bronze look. Bronze works better on me than the bright highlight, the white looking highlight. So this one was $3.49 and I can control the, with my finger. So this is in bronze glow number three because this is normally a uh, five something but it was 349 and then I had a 15% off discount on that so excuse me while I was over there um, I love these these cream mats um, I got the idea from a uh, drag queen named uh, Savannah Westbrook uh, Ray got me hooked on these so I had to get some more I wore one today so this is um, 
Here it is. Okay, so this is current jam. This is not as pink as it's looking on camera. It's more um, burgundy. So this is my favorite. So I'm going to try this one I haven't tried. This is red velvet cake. And I got sugarberry crumble. Sugarberry crumble is um, like a deep red. It's not as bright as on camera, of course. But So number 25, 26, and number 11. Then I went back and those were $3.49 a piece. So then I went back and one of my uh, old co-workers was there and she works part-time so she said what do you want for your birthday so she got me these four now these were not on sale and the cosmetics night manager would not match this price and these they they're they're uh, discontinuing them so they didn't have that many left so now i have two of these and that darkest one um i have one of those in the bathroom so I got these two cat suits were on sale. Liquid suede, liquid cat suit. So I'm adding to my collection. I got Give Me Mocha. And it's not as peach, it's more brown nude. I can't do nude nude. Looks like I have milk around my mouth. And then I got Missy and Fierce. And this is a red red. It's not this deep red. This is a bright hooker red, as my grandmother would say. So I got those two wet and wilds. And then I got two more sweet cream mats. This is really red. I'm, I'm mad that it's so... Um, let me see. No, I didn't do much. This is really bright red. So I've been trying out different reds. So this one is called Cherry Cobbler. So that's number nine. And then I got tiramisu, which is another nude. So this is a brighter nude. And then I'm going to try these. So these are only two nudes I have. I really don't have nude lipstick, and I probably need to. Oh, no, I got a lipstick lipstick. But anyway, I digress. So now I have all of the Jordanas I want. I may need to. Oh, that's not a Jordana. All the Jordanas that I want. But I need to get the darkest one, the... Um, I have it in my bathroom. I get a backup for that. Because these go quick. These I figured out a, a, a trick that works for me. And, and that's Car Carmex. No other um, lip balm. I know you're supposed to put on lip balm for a matte. But other lip balms don't hold. Um, and don't dry and crack. And make me feel like I need to rub my lips together. With this brand. Other than Carmex. Plain old Carmex. And it also works good on the liquid cat suit. But I also can use Vaseline with this. A thin coat of Vaseline. Rubbed in real good. And then put this on. And I'm good. So I wore um, current jam today. And I didn't take it off till about two hours ago. What was it? Then it held. I ate. Had a Bahama Mama drink and everything. So that's why I got this lips pencil. Because it goes perfect with both of these. So that's it, my loves, I believe. I got me a cupcake for my snack. And I got a, uh, they didn't, I couldn't, didn't, I didn't look out on any Halloween candy. So I got three of these, um, I love these gourmet, um, Oh, I don't know what to call these. These is it's some kind of candy, but this is caramel apple. So I got three of these. And that's it. And that's all. You all have a great blessed evening. This is my little haul. This part two. The previous video will be right before this one. If I can annotate it below, I will annotate where I went. Down in the um diva box. You all have a good evening. I have to put this stuff up. Take a pain pill. And call it a night. Be blessed. If this is not your type of video, keep scrolling that way. That way. Bye bye.